Hello, this is Scott W. U2O with a, another new interesting development. Uh, Warren Pratt, uh, the author of the WDSP library that powers Thetis and Power SDR before it for all of our open HPSDR type radio hardware, including the Apache Lab stuff, as well as uh, many other choices like Hermes Light, Red Pattaya, and so on. Uh, has been working recently on a, a new voice squelch algorithm. And this squelch uh, detects the presence of human speech, uh, typically for single sideband use. And when it detects human speech, it, uh, it unsquelches. It's uh, very, very sensitive. It can uh, detect, uh, with the proper AGC gain setting, it can reliably detect human voice uh, at only uh, 6 dB or about 1 S unit of SNR. And above that, it it's works very, very well. So uh, let's demo that here. You can see there's some uh, prototype controls here on the screen. Uh, certainly, this is uh, not the final UI. It's, it's strictly developmental. And uh, let's turn on some audio here and see what we can hear. Or hear what we can hear. I think there's someone who's on Scorpio. So we've got the really? squelch. Now this is going to be difficult because we've got uh, <laughs> an interfering signal. Let's switch. <laughs> Again. So with noise reduction turned on, the noise is not uh, terrible, Delta Charlie. but uh, it is there. So now we'll turn on voice squelch. North America. Anybody from North America? North America, please. Mr. Echo 2. Victor. Victor. All right, so I think you can appreciate the difference there. Absolutely quiet uh, in between voice transmissions. It's very responsive. You, uh, you, there's some adjustments here for um, mute and unmute time constants, but uh, just setting them down to the minimum seems to work very well right now. And boy, it does not take uh, much uh, at all uh, uh, on the threshold scale to make this work very, very well. So uh, one one more uh, listen here, so everybody can appreciate. Let's turn it off. Intermira, Radio Four, Germany, Mexico. Victor Echo Two, Boston, Kilo. And now back on. Victor Echo Two, Bravo, Kilo, Five Nine. Victor Echo. All right, so to wrap this up, uh, we should probably talk a, a little bit about the limitations of the voice squelch. Uh, it definitely does not work if you have, uh, you know, static crashes or, uh, you know, massively heaving noise baselines like on 80 or 160 meters with thunderstorms around. It, it won't solve that problem. <laughs> And uh, of course, there's very few things that will solve that sort of problem. Um, it uh, it will respond to uh, certain other types of signals, uh, ionosons flying through the band. You'll hear those, and um, you know certain data signals will uh, will cause it to unsquelch. But it is very pleasant to use uh, when uh, listening to uh, single sideband signals, and uh, since it can respond to signals with, again, with proper AGC gain settings, since it can respond to signals with uh, SNRs as low as 6 dB, uh, you can hear all but the uh, weakest braking stations if you are in a, uh, in a QSO with somebody. That's what I have for you today. 73 W U 2 O out.